Greetings, everyone. Thanks again once again for tuning in to Porch Talk. Of course, I'm on my porch today. It's a little chilly. It's been cold. Over the weekend, my family and I went camping. I've never been. It's, it's a place called KOA in Port Huron, and I guess they've got one in Toledo. They got various locations, but at any rate, we had a good time, but it really would have been better if it wasn't freezing. It was freezing, okay? But our cabin was cozy. Now, let's talk about Star. Star comes on Fox after Empire. I actually like the show, but it started getting out of hand like Empire. So I had my little rant on Instagram. Next thing I know, a day later, they post that it's being canceled. Now, why they're canceling the show, I don't know. Maybe that was what all the extra drama was about because they knew it was going out. But I, still, I don't even understand why end a show like that. I just, we gotta have something a little bit more positive to watch. I mean, drama is cool. Drama keeps people engaged. It's necessary. But everything can't be devastation at every corner. It's just crazy. And that's how Empire and Star is. Um, Empire has one more season left. I guess they're talking about there's an option for Jesse Smollett to be in it, but they aren't really, you know, it's not looking too good. Let's say that. I mean, it's one season left. Let the brother come back. Just let him come back. The thing about it is that incident, I don't really have a comment on. If he made all that shit up, I... That is a bit ridiculous. However, I don't think he should be cut from the show. At the end of the day, what you cutting him for? To keep it from being a circus show? Because Empire is, is that anyway. Whether you got him in it or not. No knock against Jesse, but you know what I'm saying. Lee Daniels is part of that show. But you know, at first when I was going on my rant, I was just saying tag Lee in it and people did. And come to find out. Which I thought things had become a little different. I thought we were beginning to get more creative control. And we are. But in some instances, we still have a long way to go. He has his hands in it. But you know, it goes across other people's desks or in other people's hands. And so you have these results. But ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want the show to be canceled. I just wanted them to do better. That's all. I, I mean, because at the end of the day, we've got kids watching this stuff. And kids think this stuff is reality. They want to be the cookies of the world. And they want to be super ratchet like they see different ratchet stuff in Star. And it's just like, nah. That's not, it's a little bit of that in life. Yeah, but um, it's not all bad like that. I mean, they're selling people absolutely no hope, honey. They're putting people in a, a pool of shit. A matter of fact, an ocean of shit, not giving them a canoe or a paddle with it. So we gotta do better. You know, we gotta do better. And that was my only thing, but damn, they didn't cancel the show. I hope they bring the show back. There's a petition out not to cancel it. People are signing it. So hopefully that they will bring it back, do right by the show. Keep some drama again because it's necessary. But all that death and devastation, it's not necessary. It really is not. We all know that at some point we're gonna die. We really don't need to see it. TV. You know what I'm saying? Well, thanks again once again for tuning in to Porch Talk. Check y'all next time. Bye! Make sure you choose Rocky Road Productions LLC Porch Talk to feed your entertainment needs. And you can do that by following us on Facebook, Instagram. Make sure you like this video and share it with all your family and friends. Tag somebody in it, why don't you? And don't forget to comment down below and let us know how you feel. And before you leave, make sure you subscribe. That's right. You'll catch us every week. Looking forward to see you again next time. Bye.